Hey, it's Joe Lyons. This is a quick review of how to customize your context menu in Site. So inside Site, you can right-click here. Um, I have not found a way to remove or edit the default settings up here, but after that, you can append to it. And so right here, um, first off, let me let me even close my Site User Properties file. So I'm not going to save that. Options. Go to Open User Properties. Right, that'll open this file. And then what you'll want to do is is add, like I, I already have mine in here, right? So we'll add this here. Um, and then um, when you add just two of these together, that puts in this these line breaks so they're blank. Great, come on. Um, the and then what you can do is add in other stuff, like this is my save, right? So this see this here, and and what you do is you put in the text you want, and then this is going to be like the action, the um, uh, command that gets sent to site when you do it. And I have outlined this URL here, which you can go look at, and I think I have it open right here. So here are a lot of the other things that you can put in there. This gives you a description of what they do. This is what you would put into that menu. Um, the command area that I just mentioned. So, and that's where I like to save all or close all, right? Actually, let's take close all um, as an example here. So I'm going to duplicate this line just because I don't want to have to retype all the other stuff. And I'm going to retitle this close all. So that's what's going to show up. And I think I might have to restart site. Let's see. Yes. Oh, no, there it is. Look, close all. So now if I had multiple files open, let me see if, uh, here's that one still there, so that one, and let's see if we can pop open one more, um, and this one. So now I have three open. If I hit this and say close all, right, close all of them. Now let's say it, um, open user properties, and we'll get back down to here. Um, so what you just need to make sure you do is add this, uh, just stick with this format, right? So you have your text of what you want in it. Uh, pipe, and then you have the the command, and then another pipe, and then um, a backslash, which I think, which I don't see it here, but I thought the very last one, you don't have the backslash, because the backslash is basically saying, hey, what follows on the next line is a continuation part of this. Uh, but apparently in this one, you I don't have that. I don't know if you have to eat or not. Um, these is where I had put in, I had predefined what 1140 was, but I no longer use those, so I'm not adding them to my context menu. However, you can add your own custom stuff as well. And that's it. It's an easy, easy way to customize your context menu. So, like here, I could, um, this is nice because I like to sometimes say copy as RTF. Right, and that way, when I go into somewhere to paste um, that has RTF format, it'll keep the color coding for me, which is nice. Um, what other ones did I throw in here? So, the open file of no quotes. So that one I can just highlight the path to a file and it'll automatically open it. Um, copy path of this file is very convenient. So I can say, copy path of this file, and now in my clipboard when I hit paste, that is the path to the file I'm in. So I, I really like that one. That's super handy. When I'm dealing with syntax, I want the path to that file. Um, I can toggle the line numbers. Right, so that'll toggle line numbers. So it's just easy, very easy. Um, toggle my output screen. You know, I can probably, um, even though I, I I used to like that, I just don't use it that much. So I'm going to go ahead and let's see where it is path RTM stop execution. Here it is. So and I'm just going to cheat and put. I'm going to comment it out um, in case I ever want to add it back. And you know what? Actually, I don't use that one. And close all. I'm gonna have to get rid of that. Um, the view in the line of view white space. I definitely like that. So um, why? That's weird. Let's close it and reopen it. Huh? Maybe it. it no, these seem to have. Why is the? Let me get rid of that space. Or, um, sorry, make a space after that. Boy, that makes no sense to me. I wonder if I just restarted site if it would, uh, work correctly. But that took care of it for now. Um, so that's it. Quick, easy way to customize your context menu to add in your, 
your favorite shortcuts and, and to whatnot. 